Senator Wickles. Thank you, Mr. President. I rise in support of the amendment that's here before us. Uh, we've heard many comments that say, well, this is, these are good amendments, but not at this time. Uh, there's a clock right outside the door, and it continues to run and get bigger and bigger and bigger. When is the time going to be? It's a deficit clock. We've just had a discussion on previous amendments that we know it's going to get bigger, the deficit's going to get bigger. And we're also told, well, it's a 10 percent. Where does that number come from? And we're, we haven't gotten a raise in a long time. But as I look around the circle, we all have jobs. There's people out there, forget about a raise. They're looking as to where their next paycheck's coming from. And we are the leaders. We are the legislative branch of government. If we're going to be asking our fellow state employees down the road, further down the road, because that's what we're talking about, the amendments, for furloughs, for pay reductions, then we need to set the example, as our governor set the example, by taking a voluntary pay reduction. I ask all the members of this circle to please support this amendment. Thank you, Mr. President. Thanks, Senator Whitcus. Senator